Hello, my name is Scott Jorensen. I'm one of the interventional cardiologists with the Cardiovascular Institute of the South in Meridian, Mississippi. Vein disease is a very common problem in America. It affects probably 15% of our people. Uh, when people have a blood clot in their legs, it can damage their valves and they can have long-term symptoms from that, from the valves being damaged, the pressure building up in their legs. However, as we get older, the same thing can happen, not from a clot, but simply aging and damage to the, the veins and the valves and that can cause abnormalities in the vein, in the legs. When the veins become damaged or weak over time and they start to leak and the blood flows backwards, it builds up pressure in the legs. Initially, that's typically a heaviness in the legs or a cramping, and it can eventually uh, evolve further to swelling in the legs. And in the worst cases, it can cause discoloration, darker discoloration, and then even ulcers and sores that are hard to cure. Also, it can manifest as you see spider veins or varicose veins in the legs. It's not just a cosmetic problem, it's the result of the pressure building up in the legs, which can be a progressive process over time. Symptoms from venous disease can be improved with lifestyle changes, weight loss, exercise, avoiding prolonged standing in one place, mobilizing your legs and whatnot. Also, simple support hose can give significant relief a lot of times. When I see a patient in the office, just the physical exam uh, gives all the clues that venous disease is there but confirmatory, we get a reflux study of the veins to demonstrate where the veins leak and how much do they do. Sometimes this can be treated with lifestyle changes uh, or simply a change in medications, but also other times it may need uh, an intervention to treat it. When lifestyle changes and conservative measures with support hose are not enough to relieve the symptoms, they, the vast majority of times the symptoms are greatly improved with vein ablation where we shut down the diseased vein so the blood flows through the healthy veins. And the vast majority of time that relieves the symptoms significantly. So if you have any of the symptoms of significant venous disease, swelling, heaviness, uh, discoloration, abnormal veins, we're committed at CIS to getting you an accurate diagnosis and getting you some relief of your symptoms so you can get on with your life. Mm -hmm.